So this question starts off by providing us with a system of equations. In this system, however, we're told that y is equal to 18, which means we could just take that 18 and replace y here with 18, leading us to have 18 equals negative 3, parentheses, x minus 18 squared plus 15. I can continue to simplify this by subtracting 15 on both sides of the equation, leaving me with a 3 equals negative 3, x minus 18 squared, dividing both sides by negative 3, and that would lead me to having a negative 1 is equal to x minus 18 squared. And then here we have an issue, right? Because if I am trying to solve for x here, I'd have to square root both sides, of course. And the square root of negative 1 is i, right? It's imaginary. We cannot take the square root of a negative number. So let's see what this question is asking for. If the given equations are graphed in the xy plane, at how many points do the graphs of the equations intersect? And I'm going to say they intersect at zero points, right? And the reason why that is is because I should get an x value that would represent where those lines intersect. I should get a real number for that x. But when I attempt to solve for x, I actually get an imaginary value. I get this i that comes out. I'd have i equals x minus 18, and therefore x is equal to i plus 18, which is not a real value. So that's why I'm choosing zero here. The answer to question eight is D.